Hello everybody. Today what I want to explain to you is I'm going to steam these curtains that I've made. You've seen the making of these curtains already but today my son has managed to twist my arm to come and steam his curtain for him. So and then I realized okay they're not actually fitting the window because I made it before all this was made. So we did it off of just measurements and it turned out quite well as you can see. So what I've got to do now is let me give you a little demonstration is the curtains at the moment it's got a lot of fabric in it right so what I'm doing is starting to gather this up to fit on this wig because it's a lot. So I've done this already you can see this side here needs to go in a bit more and even because you can see this one here still still trapped together so I'm spacing it out evenly by actually pulling the string so most people when they have eyelid curtains they just put it up and you've got a lot of fabric and it's not uh, uniform or it's not still so that's what I'm doing here today so what I've got here is the curve the string behind and this is what I like to use the uh, eyelid tape as well as these clips I like to use it together because it it just looks more better when someone pulls the curtain so what I do now is I pull the string as normal right so you can see how the gap the distance here is so much fabric compared to compared to this section here look it's nice and tight this bit here and when you do that this is what you see most of the time when you've got eyelid curtains up and I can't stand to see this so what I do now is gather, pull it tighter get the amount that I want up there and make this actually fit the window so you can see there's a lot of fabric in this So I'm holding the string and you see this going closer. And then when I've got what I want, then I will let it back out and fix each one as if to say, where's the tape measure has gone? By your feet. Oh, let me get it's over there. By the time I finish, right, you can see that's pulled and you can see that is like nine centimeters apart. That one is six centimeters apart and this here is five centimeters or five inches apart so by the time I finish they will all be even and that's what I'm doing today and then I'm going to switch that off and do this and you will see the end result when we are in it okay So what are you doing there? So as you can see, I'm just bringing the quality of the curtains up a bit more. Uh, majority of the time when customers buy curtains, they just hang it up and say, oh, isn't it lovely? But when you add a difference, it adds difference when you actually iron it. See, see it's curved here and it's sharp here. We get rid of all the sharpness. And you will see the difference by the time it's finished. Can you see how this has come out sharper? Yeah. Especially the lining but on this because we're up so high it doesn't really matter about the lining but we make we make this sharper 
and we iron this out because those who are passing outside at the front, which nobody will be here. Can I open this to as a red <laughs> dot? The view, so. yeah. And you say people are passing outside. Yeah, well, but so normally when this looks really perfect from the view outside, but on this occasion I don't need to iron it. And and the seam. It really makes a difference. And then I'll set it back up. My mother. Do you know, I really forgot all this needed to be done. Mm -hmm. I did. Have you managed to take all the pins out? Oh, yes, it has. That's what you see here. Well, I always miss a few. Yeah, that's fine. Just to remind you. I'll, uh, <laughs> I'll pick it up when I prick my fingers. <laughs> exactly. Well, thank you for making such lovely curtains. Yeah, you're welcome. We've had these sat in the um, the fabric sat in the garage for some years. I think it actually. I think it's maybe four years. Yeah. Was through. it when we was living here? Uh, I think we got them before we moved here. Yeah. So we've been here yeah. nearly five years now. No, I think yeah, got it yeah, four, so years. Yes. four years. So we've, yeah. had, we've had these sat in there for four years, yeah. rolled up under the cupboard, and then we did the loft extension, and my mother put together such beautiful curtains as she always does. And uh, we are eternally grateful and very proud. Okay. But I still do have this book here, so people can order from it. So I just get it from another company. Do you want to get a chair? Do you want me to do it? Do you want me to reach want up there it? for a bit? Want to? Well, I just saved you from stretching. Alright, so if I can do the other one. Uh -huh. Yeah, because this has got a nice rounded edge now, hasn't it? Yeah. Whereas these ones, they're really flat and square where they've been stored for so long. Can you see? Yeah. You can see they're all flat where they've been stored. And then you come over to this one. With a nice round edge. But in saying that, you bought it from fabric five years ago. Yeah. But it was only last year I made it. Was it a year ago you made it? I think so. So I've had it set down for a year? Probably, yeah, because um, the making of this is on the video, or it's on YouTube ah, okay. already. okay. So part two is a year later. Yeah. Yeah. So hit like and subscribe, folks. Next video is coming in another year. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Look downstairs in my jeans pocket on my on the ottoman. My wife looked at me disapprovingly. I've got her running around for the keys. Sorry, it's been a bad one. No? You can stop filming if you want. Get the view. Yeah, you know, you saw me steam in this. What I now do actually is I close it back up and I actually get to sort it out the pleats that I want, which is more or less the same thing, but I want to curve it off. Oh, this one ain't done properly. Can you see? Let me, that's, that one's not done properly. So, can you see how these are nice and curved? Nodded. All right, let me talk to you. Yeah. <laughs> can you see? Can you see how this is nice yeah, and curved? Yeah, But look at look at this one. How yeah. sharp that one is there. Yeah. So that's what I'm doing now. So I'm getting 
So I'm now going to put back the pleats in, but the way I want it. Yeah. All right, so. It's not really something I could have done, am I? <laughs> well, you have had lessons. Yeah, it's true. You have. <laughs> So, as you can see, it is not a matter of just buying your curtains and just hanging it up. It's a matter of really sorting it out and give it that showroom look of class. Look at that. <laughs> Casino, um, what's it, James Bond? Casi Royal. Casino Royal. If you look at those curtains there, those are the standard that I would give you. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Right. So here you can see the difference between the quality of that and that's how you normally when you put your curtains up. Well, this is eyelid curtains, so this is a bit kind of uniform, but when you would do it, it will still, don't squash it up. Okay. I can't believe, I can't believe you just did that. I leave it, I put it to set. I'm so sorry. I can't believe it. <laughs> I was going to open the blind, the doors. What for? To give it that ambiance. I haven't finished, I need the steam to, to set it. Don't touch it. Don't set the tips, come on. <laughs> Keep that one in the video, Mum. I am! <laughs> yes, our picnic. <laughs> Where's my drink? And my brandy. <laughs> I'll take that okay, out. Okay, so, so that's it. So I'm going to get on with the other one now and steam that. Okay, and that's it. So, um, so tell us all about your curtains now that, now that I finish. 
Okay, well, we got these curtains, well, the fabric, should I say, about four years ago, and they've been hiding away in our cupboard for this long. And finally, we've done our loft extension years yes. later, and finally, we've got the fabric out. And yes. You have done an excellent job on them. Thank you very much. Like totally exceeded our expectations. It's not mine, because I expected it to be this <laughs> yeah, <not> <laughs> Thank <mine>. you. <laughs> so you. And I highly recommend you or anybody, because you were just have the attention to detail you've got the height and the length perfect as you can see it's literally just kissing the floor yeah <laughs> even though this wasn't built exactly <laughs> yeah exactly it yeah. wasn't even built and what can i say they're just absolutely beautiful and perfect they're stunning first night in the room tonight and um i don't know if i even want can i close them can i close you them you can but wait until it gets cold i want the um pleats to set uh, it's not going to get cold up here no, no, well, no, you know the steam of it. You ready to, you ready to see the doors open? And then obviously we've got these lovely tie wraps to match. Yeah, gorgeous. And Finishing touch there. I'll show you this one as well. Yeah. Did you steam these as well, man? No, I didn't steam it. They need steaming. Yeah, do it. Oh, never mind. But I don't want to, <laughs> but I don't, I didn't want to wrap it around the curtains because I didn't want it to mark. Yeah, they're yeah, they're still set, hanging out. They're setting, yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. I'm going to open this real quick. Prepare for the 